Hi, this is Jennifer here with City Farmhouse Antiques and today I want to talk to you a little bit about how to identify authentic Galet glass, Galet cameo glass. And I find the best way to learn is actually by looking at a fake or a reproduction. And a lot of these um, Galet cameo pieces were made back in the 1990s in Taiwan and they are not authentic. This particular piece here that I'm going to show you today is not authentic. You can see by the pattern that it has the same style. And the signature, lots of times you want to look at the signature even last. The sig all, looking at all aspects of the glass and looking at the signature last, the signature then should kind of prove the other things that you have seen to be true, if that makes any sense. So like some of the big things are knowing the, the sizes and also knowing the shapes of the pieces of art glass that were made by Galet. A big, big, big tip is looking at the rim. And if you can see this rim here, you're going to see that it is has been sanded down to a flat edge. Okay? And it's been smoothed down, but the key is here it's flat. An authentic piece of Galet glass will be completely rounded, so you're not going to see this flat top. It should be rounded when you look at it and you don't have a flat top. So that's the first clue. Okay, the second clue on this piece, you want to make sure that there's no, um, a high quality piece of glass should be very consistent. You shouldn't see blotches of color or um, inconsistencies in the texture or the thickness of the glass. Um, which I can't give you any really good examples of on this, but um, another thing then looking at the at the signature. The signature on this is raised, okay? Which is another key, it's raised, and that is not an authentic signature. So you can look at, there are many um, fake signatures that give you a clue that this is a reproduction, but probably the easiest, and see that backs up what we have found here with the rim of this piece, to know that this isn't an original. Um, and again, knowing the shapes, the sizes, probably the biggest thing when buying expensive glass like this is working with a reputable dealer. You know, and, and you may pay more for glass, but at least you're going to know you're getting something that's authentic and not a knockoff. And another tip is watching for the verbiage. You know, when something is described as um, Galet style, that's not Galet. That's, that might be style. Um, Galet like or in the manner of Galet, those are all things you're going to want to stay away from. Those aren't anybody out to mislead you because they're putting it's the style but they're also telling you in so many words that that's not true authentic Galet art glass. Another thing is, as you may see, what's called tip or TIP um, on a piece of glass, that's telling you that's a reproduction, it's not an authentic piece. So these are some tips um, to kind of steer you in the right direction. Of course, when you see pieces of glass that are really, really marked down, authentic Galet, Cameo glass is very expensive. So when you see prices that are very, very marked down, that's typically, it's, it's not going to be the real deal. Um, steep discounts are typically a telltale sign that that's not a true piece of art glass, as far as a galley is concerned. So I hope this helped you. Um, you can check out our website for other tips in other blog posts about art glass and identifying art glass, depression glass, and a lot of different types of antiques and collectibles at www.cityfarmhouseantiques.com. And be sure and like us on Facebook.